When I said I was gonna finally move back into my filming room, I'm just so lazy right now. So y'all gonna have to take me like, take me as I am, or nothing at all. Did I just make that song up? Anyway, that's not why y'all here, okay? Y'all not here for me to sing, which I can't, or any of that. Y'all here for this weed that you saw in the little thumbnail, and y'all, I'm super stoked because one of my most favorite companies that I can count on to give me consistent, easy. Slay every time is Janet Collection. And they sent me your girl over three wigs, okay? And I'm excited because these three wigs, two of them, you guys have been asking me for. And one of them, I just wanted myself. So I'm super, super excited. Janet Collection, thank you so much for sending these wigs over. Y'all be sure to go check out Janet Collection on their social media, specifically Instagram, because they always upload like stuff they're coming out with. So I love them, okay? Let me tell you why I chose this wig. One, it was a wig that I saw one of my YouTube sisters in my head slay. Y'all know Nikki. She's so doggone cute, okay? I love Nikki. She's so humble. She's so down to earth. And Nikki definitely brings realness to her YouTube reviews. That's why I love her. That's why I personally watch her subscribe bell on. Um, she posted a picture of her in this wig and I fell out, hit the ground because it was in such a beautiful color. Bam, there it is, okay? It's by Janet, of course, and I have it in style Gabby, G-A-B-Y, okay? And she had it in the color that I got because she was so beautiful. I had in the color Ash Dirty Blonde, period, okay? I like my hair dirty, not my house. Let me make sure ain't nothing dirty back there while I'm talking noise, okay? Uh, Miss Gabby is heat safe up to 360 degrees. Uh, what else they say on the car? She comes with a six inch deep uh, part. And um, she's part of that Color Me collection. And y'all, we've had some winners by that Color Me collection. We've had a midnight blue wig in this Color Me collection. We've had a beautiful green, just like some a dirty rose color. Some beautiful wigs have come out of this Color Me collection. So let's look at Gabby. We ain't gonna look at the stock card because y'all, I don't even know what half that mean, okay? She came with lace that I've already cut off, but you can see it's tinted, okay? And y'all know why I feel that way. All these other companies coming out with HD this and triple decker dumb this and it, it don't work for me. So I love a simple slay. Y'all look at that dirty ash blonde. The coloring job on this, you get some dark, dirty ash, almost gray blondes, but then you get these lighter blondes. It is absolutely gorgeous. Now, the one thing that I will say that I have to do it's shiny to me at the top, okay? And you have to be careful with that with your synthetic wigs, but you just spray it with some um, dry shampoo and that'll kill the shine. Let's look at the construction and then we'll do all that, okay? She comes with a comb in the back, your adjustable straps, of course, two combs in the front, and um, there's your parting space. All right, we ain't gonna ramble. I ain't gonna play with y'all. Y'all be wanting me to act stupid, and I'm not, even though I'm 50. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's water. I'm lying, this Tito's about to. <laughs> I'ma get on that treadmill in a minute. All right, let's put Gabby on. And that's what I said about a Janet Collection wig. It fits comfortably on my doggone head. If you see me looking down, it's cause I'm looking in my mirror cause my phone's so small. Now we ain't gonna leave a wig like this cause with, with like this, mm -mm. no, okay. Let's pull it on down and put in those combs. Oh yeah, it's gonna be pretty. All right, so you see at the top, I'm getting a little bit of humpage, but I can fix that with my hot tool. Now I might go off camera and do that. But you see how it's a little shiny? I'm gonna spray some dry shampoo on it to dull it. But first, here is Gabby, straight on. Here she is to the left. And I'm 5'5". Five five. Okay, she falls at a nice, comfortable length. Okay, that's why you don't want that wig too far. Look, I like a Cro-Magnon. 
Okay, you're gonna have to pull that back. You can't have it all up at your brows like that. See, pull it back, okay? This her to the right. And this is her in the back. All right. So let me show you how I do my Janet collection weeds because you don't got to do a lot to them. Normally, just a little bit of powder up that part and like some dry shampoo sometimes to kill that shine and you're good to go. So what I'm going to do is to show y'all what I mean about shine. I'm going to spray one side and I'm going to leave one side unsprayed. All right, this side has been, I hope that's picking up. This side has been sprayed, this side has not. Do you see how this side looks a little duller? Well, in real life it do, I don't know if it is on camera. This side is duller than this side. So I'm gonna go ahead and spray the other side too. That way we can um, brush this jaw out, okay? Uh, somebody told me one time, oh, you could just use baby powder. Don't do that. I did that and that looked like I had on a powder wig. Like I was sitting in somebody's courthouse circa 19 or 1872. Okay, don't do that. Don't put no powder on that wig. Okay. All right, so now that I've killed that shine, yeah, I feel so much better now. What I am going to do is brush this out and then I am going to um, put some powder in the part. That color is just so gorgeous to me. Okay, that's this side brushed out. And this side unbrushed. All right, let me brush this one. Oh Lord, I done pulled my wig off. I ain't put them combs in. Shut up, girl. Y'all, this color, and actually, I'm gonna spray some dry shampoo down here because it's a little shiny. I don't know if that's my light. And to be honest with y'all, I don't have on my ring light. See, this would be with my ring light on. I don't got on my ring light. I just got like my lighting. Cause I'm, I'm trying to give it to you more honest because I know sometimes those lights distort the colors. Y'all, this, this color blend is one of my favorite ash color blends that are out there okay absolutely love it let's see if it can be shifted for those of you that like it to the right eh, i mean i guess it can it don't look too bad can it go to the left and yeah oh actually i like it better to the left than i do the right i actually might keep it to the left y'all i never wear my wigs to the left really that's cute huh I don't know, I'm just keep it in the middle because I don't want to hear nobody saying, you, why'd you put it to the left? You should put it to the right, shut up. All right, let's put some powder in this part. And unfortunately, I don't have my palette. All I have is this palette that I used earlier to dark root a wig. So I'm just going to go in this Juvia's Warrior palette in the color Cano. Let's hope it's close. Okay, because that part, in my opinion, can be opened up a little bit. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. That's an easy slay. And the other thing that I like about Janet Collection wigs, y'all, they so doggone affordable, okay? Love it, okay? That dry shampoo also gave it more body. This is the type of wig that I constantly be doing this all day. So, you know, so people like it. Well, I'm at the copy machine. Bam, okay? <laughs> Get out of my way, hater, okay? I absolutely love this wig, but y'all know Janet Collection is always a winner for me. Like, they're going to give me classic, easy slays like this. This is the perfect work wig, whether you get it in this color or black. Okay, and she comes in so many beautiful colors. Um, but this is a classic slay, okay? Mm-hmm, I definitely, I definitely recommend this one. Like I always say, maybe you're not even into wigs. Get it out of the way. Maybe you're not into wigs. I don't know, maybe it's your cousin Gabby. Okay. Maybe it's not your cousin, Gabby, okay? Maybe it's your Uncle Gabriel, okay? And he want to get into wigs, too. Whichever one of them we put in the wig, we'll get them white, right, honey, because this one is cute. Mm, classic slave. Uh, I'll put a direct link to where you can purchase this from a few sites that rock with us. Go look in that description box, sis. Mm-hmm.
Love it. Cute. Until next time. Thank you, Nikki, too, for reviewing it in this color. Until next time, which will be very soon. Bye, y'all.